It's Val here again. Welcome back to my channel, V Swain's Shoebox Sundays. I have another Valentine themed shoebox to show you today. Yesterday, I unboxed a Valentine themed shoebox that was for a girl age two to four. And this one is for a girl age five to nine with a Valentine theme. This box is a little bit bigger than an OCC Go box, but it is a shoe box, a pretty standard size shoe box. And I covered it with some pink duct tape that I had, and I added this little sticker that says lots of love. So let me show you what I have inside this box. On the inside of the lid, I have added the phrase with sticker letters, you are loved. And I adhered a piece of packaging from a doll that I packed in the box. It's a Na 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 doll. And the name of this doll is Valentina Moore. So she's real, real cute and I'll get to that. Okay, so this is just a pink bag, thin canvas bag that I have had for a while, but I tried to jazz it up a little bit by adding some felt pieces of hearts. And then also these butterflies are actually temporary tattoos. I got a bunch of packets of temporary tattoos, I believe at Dollar Tree. And I discovered that you can use them to decorate different things. So. I adhered them to this bag just as I would, you know, skin, your skin, like if you put them on your hand. But then I covered them with a coat of Mod Podge just to make them a little bit more permanent. So this isn't a very big bag, but she'll be able to carry some of her special things in this bag. Here's the note to... It said your love is perfect, but I adhered a piece over the your and said God that says and I added the the word God's so it's God's love is perfect and then I wrote the note and added a family photo okay along with her bag with the temporary tattoos I also put a couple of those temporary tattoos on this cup and then I covered that with a coat of Mod Podge. The Mod Podge that I use is non-toxic. It's waterproof because it says it's dishwasher safe. And on the label, it even says that it's good for use with mugs and ceramics. And so I know that it's safe enough to use that Mod Podge on a water cup or a tumbler cup. So inside this cup, and I got this cup at Walmart for, I believe it was 50 cents. So here is her doll. So this is Valentina Moore, and she is very cute. And I put her in this organza bag to protect her hair. She has this long pink hair that's in braids, and her outfit is really cute. She has this great big heart on her dress. I love her little boots, which are actually covered in plastic. Her legs are actually covered in plastic to protect, to protect the doll. And then she came with this little hairbrush that says, be mine on there. It kind of looks like a teddy bear head. Isn't she sweet? I believe I got her on clearance at Walmart. She has this little stuffy from Dollar Tree that has hearts on her paws and hearts on her little scarf, neck scarf there, and her nose is a little pink heart. She has a washcloth that I made. She has this shirt. It is a size eight. It's kind of a... Uh, teal, I guess, with some white hearts. It's from Old Navy, most likely a clearance find. She has a little Polly Pocket in this baggie. 
I, I'm not going to take it out because I put it in this bag and then put a piece of tape on it to keep it secure. And I did that because I didn't want her to lose her glasses. She has some glasses on and her shoes. So she's real cute and she, she, she didn't come with this extra dress, but I happen to have this extra long dress so she can, she came with this shorter dress so she could dress her, her Polly Pocket up like a princess if she'd like to. So she has this hygiene packet here. She has a smaller bar of soap, two mending kits, some dental floss, a Valentine themed lip balm, and I have a nail clipper and a nail file and some band-aids. She has a little heart container here and inside there is a bejeweled ring from Dollar Tree. She has this hairbrush that is a wet brand hairbrush and it has hearts. It's decorated in a heart and striped pattern. So she has this pencil case. If you, it's one of those bags where if you start zipping, it goes, the zipper goes all the way around the bag. And if you keep zipping, you'll end up with a great big long piece. I believe I have all the bases covered, like I always say. So that's her pencil bag. Toothbrush with a cap. She's got a building block set from the Bullseye Spot at Target with the pinks and whites and reds blocks. She has two strands of beads, one pink, one red with hearts. She has some bounce balls, red and two pinks. She has this set. So it comes with several pieces to scratch and the scratch stick. She has some Valentine themed colored pencils. I got these from Walmart. I paid full price for these. They were 98 cents. Can't wait to go back tomorrow, which is Valentine's Day, later in the day to see if anything has been marked down. In this Mylar bag, she has several Valentine themed fun erasers, some pink pencil cap erasers, a heart-shaped pencil sharpener, her pink school eraser, and in this Mylar bag, she has a bunch of stickers. She has some Jojo Siwa lenticulars that have hearts on them. She has a few of those. That one says, love ya. This one says, be mine. That's a skateboard sticker. And then these two are fun ones that came in a packet that had holiday themed chipboard stickers. They are self-adhesive. This one says, love ya a latte. <laughs> I think that's so cute. And that one says, love notes. And then this is just a heart BFFL best friends for life. So lots of fun stickers. And then she has these 3D stickers that are Valentine themed that have little different creatures on them. A hedgehog and a cat, I believe. So she has four of those. In this Mylar bag, she has even more goodies. She has another lip balm that came in the set of Valentine themed lip balm. She has two heart shaped plastic bracelets. She has some hair ties that have heart beads on them. She has some silicone rings, different colors, a pink, a red, and a purple that have hearts on them. She has some pink hair clips in here. Here she has a red fidget spinner She has a click pen, a multi-click, a multi-click pen. She has this heart patterned bandana. So I believe I got these at Dollar Tree. This one has red hearts on it. She has a memo pad here that has a magnet on the back. It has hearts on it. It's a love lined memo pad and it has hearts. 
She has another bounce ball here. She has a package of Crayola crayons. She has this little coloring book. It's got some little pages for her to color. Just a little mini coloring book. I love that right there. The heart and that flamingo. I got these mostly for pencil packs, but I stuck one in this box. So she has a composition book, which is pink, and I put another one of those self-adhesive ephemera, ephemera pieces that says Love Note on the cover. And inside, she has a lot more stickers. She has some stickabilities. Got these on clearance at Hobby Lobby. These are Valentine themed stickers with those pretty girls on them. She has some with hearts, some fun stickers. She has, so she has a lot more that came out of a book of stickers. Lots of fun stickers for girls in this age group. Silly creatures on this one. So she has several stickers. She has a doodle journal that has from Dollar Tree that has hearts on the cover. Heart silhouettes inside the book on some of the pages. Lines on the other pages for journaling. She has a dream catcher from Dollar Tree that has a beautiful rainbow colored or tie dyed heart. She has this coloring book, a rainbow high jumbo coloring and activity book. And there's a bonus character bracelets on the back so she can cut those out. And with her glue stick, she can make bracelets. I'll have to double check and make sure I put a glue stick in her pencil pouch. The pages have these really cute girls and I know there is a couple of right there's a picture of a girl that has a heart on her sweater. So a very nice coloring book for this age group. And she has this highlights hidden pictures book, snapshots, and other hidden picture puzzles. So I love these hidden picture picture books from highlights. And then she has one more object. It's a pen that has glitter, but it is not no liquid, just glitter. So just a fun novelty pen. I don't remember where I got it, but it was probably Dollar Tree. So I have one more box to show you, Valentine themed for a girl age 10 to 14. And maybe I'll upload that one actually tomorrow on the actual Valentine's Day. So thanks for tuning in for this unboxing. I hope you enjoyed this one. And I'll also link to the video that I uploaded yesterday for the girl two to four with a Valentine theme. As always, I really appreciate you watching. I hope you'll like, comment, and subscribe. And so I'll see you again real soon. Bye for now, friends. Quick update, I added socks and underwear to the box when I repacked.